All right, welcome to Wild Cargo. As promised, our other home away from home. Let me give you a little background history on what we're all about here. So about 12, 13 years ago, my husband and I took over our family pet store business and we noticed that with all the big box stores and the chain stores moving into town that they were selling pets in mass numbers and not educating the buyers about the responsibility they had to properly care for those animals. So that's when we came into play. We noticed animals being dumped left and right, left at dumpsters, and we saw a need. So my husband and I opened our doors up here at Wild Cargo to all the unwanted exotic animals in Palm Beach County. And that has turned into just about all of South Florida. So last year in 2019, we took in 1,564 animals that we took off the streets. They were either surrendered to us, they were rescues, whatever it might be, we took them with open arms and we found them loving homes. We know that breeders sometimes can get overwhelmed, things can get out of hand, so that's how we got all these lovebirds over here that are next to me. A breeder was breeding them, got busy with his normal day job, and surrendered all these to us so that we could adopt them out to loving homes. And if you keep following me back here, I'll show you the other fuzzy animals, but first I gotta stop, gotta take my chicken foot and pick my teeth. Maybe brush my hair. <laughs> These are all dog treats. We sell natural dog treats. No raw hide or anything like that. We're all about natural here. <clears throat> and then for those of you who have a uh, gambling problem, we also feed those addictions. <laughs> Anyways, but follow me along. Well, they're not out right now, but there's some pet rats in here for adoption. And all these petters, we have the guinea pigs and rabbits available for adoption. And then for those of you that like the more exotic animals, we have a chinchilla who will never be made into a fur coat. Isn't he cute? They're a bit of a high maintenance animal, so they take a little longer to adopt to find the right suitable home. Come on, come on. I'm gonna show you something really super cute. So when this bunny came to us, she was acting a little odd. So we had a sneaking suspicion that she was pregnant. And sure enough, she gave birth to some adorable babies. Look at this one. It looks like it's wearing mascara. It's a little Maybelline. <laughs> Isn't she cute? Hold on, there's another one that I gotta show you. Hold on, darling. This one's a little like calico. Isn't it cute? So they'll be available for adoption soon. As soon as they're weaned, they can go to their new home. All right guys, I'll be back. Hi mama. They're all waiting for their treats because it's first thing in the morning and they know that it's feeding time here. But before the crowds start racing into our doors, we wanted to go ahead and do this video right quick to introduce ourselves. I think today we're just going to work on the introducing you to all the little mammals and such. Oh, these guys are super cute. Now, a lot of people think rats are disgusting, but they are absolutely not disgusting. They're highly intelligent animals. This is a little Dumbo rat. And I think its sibling is not a, woo! <laughs> no, its sibling didn't turn out to be a Dumbo, but they are available for adoption. Bye guys. And then if you come over here, don't mind anything, we're a work in progress here. <laughs> These are all different breeds of chickens. Here in Palm Beach County, backyard chicken keeping has become extremely popular because people are getting woke, so to speak to what's going on with our food system, and they're wanting to grow their own fresh organic eggs. So each week, we get in different breeds of chicks from the USDA certified hatcheries so that people can keep them in their backyard and raise their own food. So this is just a brief section of our shop. Later on, we'll tour you of our fish department and we'll tour you inside the reptile room. Wait. Can we go that way really quick? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Really quick before we open, I just wanted to show you 
This is our takeout menu. Don't mind the mess here. Like I said, we're under remodel. We have cockroaches. We have frozen chickens. We have hornworms. We have superworms. We have waxworms. We have rats. We have mice. We have crickets. We have all kinds of bugs that you could imagine. African soft for rats. Anyways, people come here to this window and they order their takeout for their animals. So how cool is that? So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this brief area of our shop. I gotta go up and I got people waiting.